Hi, this is the first video of my tutorial series, Game Material Development Workflow. Uh, first, let's talk about me. Uh, my name is Ufuk Choban, as known as Atmuch at Modo and Unity Forms. Uh, I am not a English native speaker. And also, I am not a uh, CG expert. So, uh, I can say something wrong. Uh, please uh, warn me by commenting these videos. In this tutorial series, uh, I will work uh, Wacom uh, Synthetic Companion Hybrid uh, as my desktop and also I will use uh, Mischief for whiteboard I have two reasons for this uh, first uh, there is no canvas limitation uh, it has infinite canvas and also there is no resolution problem Uh, and also I will use uh, model uh, from the foundry and I will use unity and I will use uh, some products from I like read make and from Mixamo. Uh, my workflow will be will start with Fuse from Mixamo. I will create my character here and then I will upload this character to Mixamo website. I will uh, auto rig it here and then I will import Mixamo output FPX here and then I will use it at Unity as a result. In fact, uh, there is a workflow without using Moto. Uh, you can upload uh, your character to Mixamo can auto rig it and then you can import to unity if you use this way uh, you will lose some optimizations I will use modo to make this optimizations and it will work better in unity okay first I will create my character at fuse uh, in fuse you will see uh, it will generate some different meshes like hair uh, skin uh, top wear bottom wear and some other clothes like eye wear uh, and Shoes. Fuse will uh, generate uh, different texture maps for all these parts. Let's make it a little colorful. And also, Fuse will generate different UV maps. And also, it will generate uh, different meshes. After I upload those to Mixamo, I will get uh, all those uh, to Modo uh, 
uh, with additional rig. In modo, I will bake those uh, texture maps to a single texture map and also uh, this process will make it a single UV so in here I will have single UV and single texture map and single mesh I will import this to unity and uh, you will see uh, it will work faster in real time at unity uh, and also I will explain here let's zoom it there is an FPX importer it has little problems uh, and I will show you workarounds in that way uh, you will get uh, this FPX file uh, properly to modo and also uh, before importing it to modo here I will explain game uh, material optimization process so uh, you will know why do you need to do something in modo before exporting in unity uh, unity accepts fpx file uh, and there's a lxo file importer uh, it's a python script uh, it opens uh, the modo scene lxo file and it converts it to colada file and then imports it to unity i will use my uh, custom script and i will share it with you and here lxo Porter. Uh, I will use it uh, in that way uh, you can import multiple animations and other stuff um, I think if I missed something uh, after you uh, we uh, import uh, this file to unity we will select shaders here Because in this character there will be uh, transparent parts so we will use a uh, transparent shader for them like hair and eyelashes and for clouds we will use different shader and for eyes uh, specular parts uh, we will use different shader and also uh, we will use a skin shader uh, for skin and also I will show some tricks in unity to play animations uh, better yes I think that's all uh, in this at the end of tutorial series uh, you will be learning this I will use uh, several short videos for this for example uh, generating character at views this will be one video and uploading it to uh, Mixamo site this will be one video and then here I will show uh, game optimizations uh, I will make uh, a separate video for importing this FPX to modo and I will make different video for baking process and optimizations and I will uh, make a single prop here I will model it uh, and I will <laughs> make a textures with substance designer also I will use substance painter
to make textures of this prop and I will export it to Unity. Uh, in the current version of Fuse, uh, PBR materials, materials are not uh, supported also uh, in Modo. Uh, in the next version, uh, I know both uh, Fuse and Modo will support them. And I will try to explain some PBR conversions here. And also I will use Substance Designer uh, for a different purpose. Uh, I will merge uh, color map and transparent maps to use with Unity. For animation, uh, I will use ACS. Uh, in Modo, uh, I will uh, use a mix summary and I will transfer it to ACS and I will make animation uh, with ACS. Yes, for now that's all. Uh, you can subscribe this playlist. Uh, I will add my uh, each video to this playlist. Uh, if I do something wrong, I can correct the video and uh, replace the video in this playlist. So, uh, I suggest you do uh, subscribe and follow this uh, playlist. Okay, thanks for watching.